It's people empowering themselves from the grassroots to move up together as a community to change the continent. People who believe that everything can happen. I think motivation, passion, the same kind of revolution there. You could feel it here. Whereby citizens of countries can actually take responsibility for the future. With vision to change Africa, not only to rely on the government or the leaders that we have. People are awakening and being able to say, okay, this is what we want, this is what we don't want. You've been there for 30 years. We'd like to see a different face, a different person who's president. Africa is a, a young continent and, and youth and technology sort of go very well together. Networked minds are greater than the sum of their parts. And I feel that through um, the social networks or through technology in general, we are able to capture ideas. Then we get to hear, oh, in, in Kenya, they had a, a water problem and this is what they did. In South Africa, they had an issue with electricity and this is what, the, what they did. We are here to solve these problems, like to change Africa to a peaceful place. I feel that there'll be more democracy. Uh, a free and fair election will have smooth transition of government. Where youths come up with initiative, innovative ideas that create employment for thousands of people. I want to see Africa just, just as beautiful and natural as it is now, but developed. An Africa that is actually not just the dark continent, but an Africa that is part of the world. I think the future of Africa depends on the next generation.